What is up everyone? Jaron here. Hope you're safe and great for this video. Mag-a-unbox tayo ng isang UPS. Dahil madalas kaming mawala ng kuryente, kailangan ko nang mag-UPS. And before we start with the video, if you are looking for quality printed materials, you can check Prince Park Co. And if you are looking for quality educational or tutorial services, you can check Education. And I'll put their links down below. So guys, let's unbox this UPS. Alright, so I got this Orion UPS 1050VA from Shopee for a price of 3,000 pesos. Medyo mura siya compared sa other um, sa other UPS out there. Nari matagal ko na naririnig yung Orion brand. I think a power supply company before. So narinig ko na sila sa Orion. Mga cases din, gumagawa din sila. So um, kung brands lang din, I think this is great. And nakuha ko siya ng napakababang halaga kasi... Yung, yung aking computer is around 600 watts yung uh, kinukuhang power or I, I mean at the maximum so kailangan ko ng UPS na makakatapat doon so ang kailangan ko was 900 VA and up so I got this 1050 VA volt ampere that's 1050 volt ampere so around 600 watts 600 to 650 watts yung kaya niyang i-accommodate so which, which is Sobra pa dun sa aking um, ginagamit everyday talaga. Papakita ko na lang yung specification sa inyo. Pipicture ang ko. And buksan na natin tong box na to. Da Napakabigat nito. Sobrang ramdam na ramdam mo yung bigat nitong UPS na to. So, ayan. So, yun nga. Uh, para saan ba UPS? Kung madalas kayong um, nababrownoutan kagaya dito sa amin, madadamage kasi yung components mo pag wala kang UPS or biglang namamatay yung iyong computer ng, ng hindi sinasadya basta suddenly mag turn off siya may kakaroon kasi ng surge ng kuryente and hindi naman laging ma-accommodate ng power supply mo yun diba? may hangganan lang yung kayang mag turn off bigla ng power supply mo so um, kailangan talaga tong UPS para at least may time ka para ma turn off mo or kung may ginagawa kang mga works para ma save mo din sila bago mo i-turn off yung computer. Ayan. So, usually sa mga ginagamit to for surveillance cameras or surve surveillance PCs para hindi sila mamatay in case na mawalan, mag-brown out or mag-black out. So, para tuloy-tuloy pa rin yung footage ng mga cameras. Alright, so umorder din ako na itong um, power cord na to. Kasi naubusan ako ng power cord. So, ayan. Kumuha ko ng dalawa. Sa halagang 50 pesos each. So, murang-mura. So, buksan na natin itong UPS na napakabigat. <laughs> Grabe. Grabe to. I'm not sure kung gano'ng kabigat to exactly. Pero, grabe. Siguro more than 5 kilos yung bigat nito. Pakaliit niya, no? Kumpara dun sa weight niya na sobrang bigat. Grabe. I hope na tatagal tong UPS na to since um actually wala naman ako nababalita na UPS na nasisira agad. Talagang yung mga UPS pang matagalan talaga. And 24/7 yung usage. Uh, baka ganun din gawin ko, mag 24/7 din ako kasi syempre pag may mga din na downloads, yan kailangan nakabukas lagi. So sa likod meron siyang tatlong black na socket and one white, yung isa naka-label as printer very specific, I'm not sure why pero itong tatlo, pwede natin ilagay dito yung ating um, computer and yung monitor, meron din siyang fuse dito, ayan and um this is a 250 volts 5 ampere and ang input nya is 220 volts uh, 50 hertz so ayan, ito yung harap nya feel lang natin itong plastic ayan, so meron tayong on and off and then there's normal, there's backup. So I think mag on yung backup pag um, nawala na ng kuryente. And then there's normal if nakasaksak pa siya. So meron din tayong manuals. And meron din tayong extra na fuse. So that's very thoughtful. 
Ayan, meron tayong extra na fuse para if ever pumutok man yung fuse natin, meron tayong kapalit. So, that was all for our unboxing of this Orion VA1050 UPS, an interruptible power supply. If you have comments, just comment down below. If you like this video, like this video, share, and then subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed yet for more tech stuff like this and for more unboxing like this. So, uh, guys, I'll see you on the next one.